Okay, here I'm going to turn the autopilot master switch on. And this is the self test. All the lights will go out here in a second. You can maybe hear the servos in the background clicking. All the lights go out. And here in a few seconds, the green ready light will come on, which means it's ready to go. Okay, now the first button is uh, the wing leveler. And all that will do is uh, level the wings or hold you in a turn controlled via this knob here. You can see that would have been a, a left turn, a left circle, and it would just hold you in that, and that would just hold you in a right circle, and you can do that for any degree of bank. Okay, and now I'm going to set the, the heading bug. Now I'm on the ground here, but it still works. So I set the heading bug, put the autopilot in heading mode, and you can see the yoke is uh, trying to turn to the heading. Now, of course, I'm on the ground, so it won't work. I just adjusted the heading bug off to the right, and now the plane wants to turn right in an attempt to intercept that heading. And I just put it a little bit to the left, and now it's slowly trying to uh, catch it off to the left there. And down here is the altitude hold button. Blue light comes on, and it will hold, or attempt to hold, whatever altitude that you're on. And I just dis disconnected it. And then that there is the autopilot disconnect button. It disconnects everything, and you can see it goes nuts for about five seconds and it's completely disconnected and